Hello YouTubers, Paul here, your channel host, right into my channel. Well, um, it's actually four years ago since I actually did um, the, one of these. Um, 2017 now, and um, a week past Sunday, I'm a celebrity. Get me out of here! Started. Um, the camp, we're into our, the second week of the, the celebrities all being in the jungle. Um, the last time I did a review for the show um, was in 2013. If you check on the vlogs in 2013 on the playlist, you'll come across it. Or in the review section on my channel, on the playlists. Also, um, in 2014, I did a, a vlog called Yelm, which is titled Yelm Mel, which was um, a twist on it, which was for I'm a Celebrity, for the extra camp. And then in 2015, I did a... Fans say what? Um, thing for extra camp as well, which unfortunately weren't broadcast. So I'm going to do a quick review. What I'm going to do is read out the celebrities' names that, as they appear on the opening titles of the show, go through them and give my opinions on each one, and also give my opinions on the presenters, Ant Ant and Deck on the main show. And then you've got Scarlett, Joel and Joe on the extra camp. So here we go. First one who appears on the, on the titles, as I say, I'm just going to read out as they appear on the titles. Jenny McAlpine. Um, I've actually just this week stuck £2 on her to win. Um, I think she'll win with her being, having the big uh, backing of the Coronation Street fans. Um, hope that she wins. She was my early favourite to win, so see what happens with her. Um, she is fairly in the background at the moment. She hasn't done any tasks yet, um, so see what happens anyway. Next one on the um, titles is Dennis Wise. Um, God, I think, has he done any tasks yet? I'm not sure if he has. Um, he's... Um, all right in the camp um ex-football player um don't really have much to say about him sorry um georgie georgia top uh top low or uh from made in chelsea or toff as she's known on the show um i thought when i first saw her on the show i thought she was just gonna be a blonde bimbo and she's just gonna be another one of these reality stars but actually she's coming into her own she's actually quite bright um, she knew who Stanley Johnson was, who was another contestant, and um, Boris Johnson's dad. Um, she was quite good. Um, yeah, I think as well she's possibly contending to win, or get down to the last two or three. I would say definitely. Next one, Kezia Dugdale, um, MP in Scotland. I think she's for the Labour Party. Um, she she came in in the second week. Um, with another contestant, Ian Lee, and no, sorry, she didn't come in the second week. She was the sec. She was the, uh, the two the she was the the two competitors who came in second, and <laughs> she's she hasn't done anything. She's just been right in the background. Amir Khan. Um, I thought he'd been a lot tougher with the being and being a boxer, but the first, um, first. Trial he did, he actually uttered the immortal words, I'm a celebrity, get me out of here. He was too scared because he pulled a small snake out of the out of one of the holes and he, he wanted to get out. Second trial though, he psyched himself up and he managed to do it. So well done Amir. Um don't know if he'll win. Next one on the titles is Jack Maynard, YouTube vlogger. Now he didn't last all that long in the jungle because there's a bit of controversy where there's some old tweets that he'd sent years ago where he had so he had to be pulled out so he could answer give answer to those um tweets um it, there was controversy there was ITV was there was in the press they were saying that ITV had decided to bring him out but then his management had also decided to bring him out so to give him a fair chance to answer the um to give you know to answer the tweets that had surfaced um so read into what who read into who you think 
actually pulled him out. Um, for me, did he should he have came out early, um, early? I don't know. Um, tweet was sent about ten years ago. Got to be careful on social media if you're into this. Like, but there again, was he? No, was a YouTube blogger that long ago. Um, I've, I'm not sure. Because uh, I haven't paid much attention to him, but chat made on as I said there, uh, he is a YouTube blogger, um, like me, but obviously he's much more high he does it professionally. I don't do it professionally. Um I might actually talk about that in one of my other vlogs. Um next for next Sunday. Um next contestant on the titles is Shappy uh Kassan, Kassandi, who's a stand up comic. I've heard of her, but I wanna say I've heard of her, but can't place where from. Next one is Vanessa White um, from the Saturdays pop group. I've never heard, um, I've heard of the Saturdays, but I don't know the individual member, members, so I can't say I've heard of her. Jamie Lomas from Hollyoaks. Um, I don't think I've seen him in many of it. I don't think he's done any of the um, trials yet, but he's one of these who wants to get stuck in if you know what i mean um then there's ian lee who's just who came in with keddy and doug dale um he, those two were the second ones who came into the jungle if you know what i mean after the rest the main people came in um he was another celebrity who actually said i'm a celebrity get me out of here um on the first trial he did because he was the to be fair he was too tall to do the the trial. It was an underwater um, obstacle course where they had to he had to uh, get loads of um, he had to go through tunnels and he was just too tall to do it. And he was getting stuck at the first hurdle. Next one, Rebecca Vardy. Um, she's a wag, uh, married to a football player. Um, have I heard of her? I'm not sure. I don't. I think I have, but. Just with her being a wag, um, that's it. And Stanley Johnson, I hadn't even heard of him. I've heard of Boris Johnson. Yes, I know his son. Um, not personally, obviously. But I know his son with him being an MP. But Stanley Johnson, no. And he's just like his uh, dad, his son. He's the uh, same mannerisms, same voice and everything. Um, when I saw, because I the first show I taped and then I watched after it had gone out live because so I could whistle the adverts. Sensible me. And when I saw Ant and Deck tweeting saying um Stanley Johnson, even prime future Prime Minister's son, I thought, are oh, they having a laugh? And because I thought they were just joking on and then I realised it was actually um Boris Johnson's dad. Um Yeah, so um I didn't even realise it was him who, I didn't realise it was um, Boris Johnson's dad. And he's full of facts and figures. Quite an interesting fella to watch. Um, and yes, so that's my take on all the celebrities this year. Um, so now on to the presenting team. Um, Ant and Deck, brilliant as usual. Um, not more you can say about them. Ant recently has been in therapy for an addiction to drinking drugs because he there was a knee up went bad or something and he was addicted to painkillers. Glad to say that he's back and he's on the mend because there was a question he may not be able to do the jungle this year, um, but he's back on form. Excellent. And then we're joking about it on the first show. So well done. Loved the references to Biker Grove as well in the first week. <laughs> well done, guys. Never forgot your roots. Um, as for the... Um, extra camp, you've got Joel Domit, who was one of the com uh, contestants last year, comedian. He's a stand-up comic this year. You've got um, Scarlett Moffat, excellent. Do you know what? I would love to be um, a fly just around her one day, and just to, or just no, I'd just love to be to to love to see how her brain ticks and see how her mind works. Because some of the things that she comes up with, some of the theories she comes up with, she's just excellent, man. Keep the good work, Scarlet. And finally, um, Joe Swash is back. Um, excellent. He's just, 
he's just Joe. <laughs> yeah, um, what more can I say? Anyway, that's my take on the series. Um, and yeah, see you later, YouTubers. <laughs>